Hey there, I'm Frodo, and we are playing Battletech. So, uh, I believe, we, I'm just looking at the money here, we have very, very little money. <clears throat> I believe we are going to do the story mission. We have to travel for both of these, uh, and uh, this one pays okay, but it's in Lyreton. I think we're going to go with this one. Pay is good, salvage is good, uh, 25 day travel, which puts us right up against the uh, 26 days of our financial report, <coughs> which is what I was a little uh, worried about, but I um, think we're okay. It would be nice if we could do some more uh, ship upgrades, but uh, money is tight. Although, don't we have, we can maybe sell some mechs here. We do have Panther and a Vindicator that I don't think we're going to use either one of those two. Um, so let's just sell them. Let's sell them off and see how that improves their financial situation. Considerably. So now we could potentially go and do something um, like that. 20 days. It'll finish before we get to, uh, to our mission. And I uh, guess us three tech points which is going to max us out other than getting this guy. That's probably the cheapest one we can get. Um, and the other ones are all just prerequisites for other things, other than the recreation. I'd, it'd be nice to get more morale, but it's probably the one I care the least about right now. Um, this one I would like to get to as well. Um, but I think uh, we have to get this one first, and this one costs a lot of money. So we're going to go with this one, just because it's so cheap. And uh, then we are actually going to check the store before we leave the system, just in case there is something interesting here. Um, there's an enforcer. I can't afford to buy a full set. There's a large laser. A couple of large lasers, actually. <coughs> but other than that, there is nothing uh, all that interesting. There is an LRM-20. Uh, I would prefer an LRM-20+. plus. But I do believe, actually, that we have a long-range... Um, so it's this guy. We do have a LRM... Um, I think the Griffin has two LRM-15s. Could be the Trebuchet, instead of two LRM-20s. So that could be interesting to swap that out. Um, I'm not sure if I care enough to get these guys. Uh, they are pretty expensive though, so maybe we'll just stick with it. So let us take that mission and be on our way. That guy, uh, Liberation Smithon, Smithon, I don't know how to say, Smithon, 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 I don't know. Uh, so we just, uh, oh here, uh, so. Blaring klaxon interrupt an otherwise quiet morning routine as several fast moving ships appear, pacing the Argo. Darius broadcast their hail to the bridge. Uh, you're flying through our space, strangers. It's awfully dangerous out here. Just awful. Especially for a ragged looking ship like the Argo, is it? Tell you what, we'll provide you with safe passage for a price, of course. While you consider your options, Samara pipes up. Commander, if you buy me some time, we could do a rapid fire up with the Leopard. That'll teach him not to mess with us. <coughs> Well, we could pay him off. We could stall until the leopard is ready. That's probably going to break something. Or we could broadcast from for help. Well, that's a safe option, isn't it? Um, I think we're going to go with this one. I don't want to pay. I don't have the money, though. Let's do that. Ah, Medusa suffers two injuries. Darius sends an SOS, uh, and you said about buying time until help arrives. Before long, the pirate captain informs you she's having a bad day and fires a few lasers blast off at the side of Argo. Uh, seven ships arrive on the scene, bearing the clubs of local authorities. With the curse, the captain, captain gives the order to retreat. Unfortunately, it's too late for Medusa, who was caught on the wrong side of a blast door and ends up in the med bay. Two injuries, which will put him out of misery. Oh, wow, 46 days. Bummer. <clears throat> 
bummer. Well, um, good thing we got those new mech warriors here. We did uh, hire a few new ones. So we have three. Our three best ones are out. Um, we do have Sh Showtime and Venom, and I guess we're bringing Spitfire and Decker. Um, Yes, that's a thing now. But we'll worry about that when we get there. Actually, these, those two will be back by the time we get there, so it's not such a bad, not such a bad uh, deal. Okay, uh, is there anything we want to do with the mechs? So we have the blackjack, we have the shadowhawk, we have the panther, we have the centurion, uh, we have the griffin. We have the trebuchet. I see two 15s on the trebuchet. So that would have been nice to have a little bit bigger, but we can always do that later. <clears throat> um, I have been thinking about refitting this. But I think we're going to keep it. I think we're going to just leave it the way it is. So, um, do we? Should we put anything to storage, maybe? How many do I have? One, two, three, four, five, six. Six is probably m more than we need ready, but we could potentially put the uh, Panther into storage. I don't know how much more we would use it at this point. Um, it is fast and light and has fairly good armor for its size. And it also packs a bit of a punch. And I think, um, yeah. I think, uh, I was thinking it might be good with called shots, but I did a little bit of research and it turns out that the called shots for SRMs, um, it's only the first shot that gets the percentage that's shown and then every consecutive shot is half of that. So if the first one's 20, the second be 10, then be 5, then 2.5, and, and then practically 0. Uh, oh, we're doing, doing a couple of jump, a couple of jumps here. I didn't actually think to look where um, oh, we're, dock, we're undocking here where um, this system was hey, Smithen. let's take a look at the star map here um, it's right here that's an interesting place uh, periphery level, poor, small population so there's not going to be any fancy weapons here most likely which is unfortunate but it is what it is uh, five days till we get there, six days till our financial report, 30 more days for Medusa, unfortunately. Let's, I just want to take a quick peek at the store, which is not really a quick peek, but that's the same one we just didn't want to buy. 25 crit, LRM 10 plus plus. Yeah, if that was a 15, I'd buy it. PPC plus, plus five damage. Um, ooh, what is this? A gyro, that is a lot of money, plus two hit defense. Uh, what does two hit defense mean? <clears throat> does that mean it's harder to hit me? Gyros counteract the massive amount of momentum generated from mech engines and allow for precision maneuvering and recovery from stability impacting attacks. All mechs come equipped with a stock gyro which can be upgraded for improved performance. I don't know what that means. Plus two hit defense. Uh, it's gyro plus, actually. It's not just a gyro. Plus two hit defense. Does that make it easier, harder to hit? Does it make it easier for me to hit? I guess it makes it harder for them to hit me. Maybe I'll quickly Google it here while we have load screens. Uh, not yet. We do want to do our mech warriors that we're gonna bring. We're gonna wanna. We're gonna bring her. Um, should we save up for this, or should we? No, I think we're gonna. She's our close combat, so we're probably gonna get called shot bonus on her. We're gonna keep up. That guy. Decker, you're not coming. Glitch, you have 2800. Probably want to go there. Um, call 
Double shot bonus. What can I do for you? That would be the recall penalty. He already has the recall penalty. Uh, I think we're going to go for the called shot bonus for him. Glitch, we're going to go for the recall penalty. We don't care about that one, actually. Uh, she is in the other <coughs> close combat, isn't she? So we will go for that, I guess. So that was Behemoth, Glitch, Showtime, and Venom. Where we are going to go for, I think, this one. Because she uh, she shoots the... She has the Alaran stuff. Okay, we're gonna launch a contract. Did I click it? Yes, I did. Okay, let's... Uh, um, okay, Trebuchet, Showtime, no. Um, right? I think so. So it just gave him called shot, right? Yeah. And then Glitch goes... Uh, no, this isn't right. This isn't right. Is this right? Hang on. I'm confused. Shadowhawk. What did I just give her? Man, it was like 30 seconds ago. How can I not remember this? Um, I just gave her piloting, I think. Darn tootin', no, I can't remember. It was like five seconds ago. Well, probably a minute ago now. But. Uh, reduces indirect fire. Which six and five. <clears throat> Piloting's for melee. So this is a melee, and that's a melee. Uh, I want it like that. No, I want it like this. <clears throat> Now, do I want? Do I want? Uh, she has better piloting, so she's going to be in the one that does more damage. Um, piloting six, tactic six. Yeah, we're going to leave it like this, I think. Yep. And um, let's see here. Ba ba. Sorry, I am. While this is loading, I am going to Google the Baltic Gyro Plus. This is on my phone here, so you can't see it, but I am very curious about what that actually does. I, um, so I'm going to buy one of those when we come back from this mission, if we can afford it. Let's see here. Um, well, this is a. That is a. Uh, Hmm. Gyro corrects torque. Uh, this is uh, hmm. this doesn't actually help me because that plus one hit defense. Here we go. Battletech general discussion. That's what I want. Uh, the restoration army is engaged in a battle of attrition against the Directorate forces, and our ground forces need to resupply if they're going to prevail. To that end, I'm sending you to capture our Directorate munitions dump, eliminate their defenses, and prevent them from getting away with the munitions. Our support staff will handle the rest. <coughs> Okay, welcome Smith and Commander. The bulk of our army is entrenched in the capital and exchanging fire with what's left of the Directorate's Defense Force. The battle is leaning in our favor, but we're running low on ammunition. That's where you come in. The structure before you is the ammunition stump that the Directorate stole from House Kerasus. I need you to take it back. Find all hostile units and eliminate them. Eliminate them. Our combat support staff will handle the rest. Uh, I've highlighted several optional objectives for you on this mission. They'll all pay equally well. Saving some of the ammunition that's already packaged for transport will earn you a bonus payment. If you manage to pursue the bulk of the ammunition, ammunition, you will receive a second cumulative payment. Finally, I will pay you a bounty for any directory transports you manage to destroy during the engagement. Okay, we're going to try and get as much as possible because we want to get the Jar Plus, which, according to Bloody Steam user, says... Uh, gives you a mech a 5% less chance on each attack to succeed on you which means uh, a plus 2 would be 10% harder for them so if they um, if they have a 90% chance if I put a 
plus two hit, it would just be eight. I guess is what that means. <clears throat> This assignment comes with risks. The facility is heavily guarded, and if any of those munition crates come under fire, the resulting explosion will deal heavy damage to anything caught in the blast. This includes direct rate units, so feel free to target the crates yourself, but know that you may be sacrificing a bonus in doing so. Okay, so we're going to try not to blow them up. Good hunting, Commander. Take out those battle mechs and okay. mind the crates. I will mind the crates. I don't have anyone with sensor lock. I just realized that is um, that is a little upsetting. What is that? That is an ammunition crate. So I have to walk up to it, and that sets it off. Or does that save it? I'm saving that. I'm guessing that saves it. Let me contact. Okay, we got a guy there. We got a turret here. A couple of guys there. You gonna brace? Uh, Behemoth's turn, she can get, wow, she can run really far, holy moly cannoli, um, she can shoot that ammo crate from there, which we're not going to want to do, but uh, she could if she wanted to. There's <clears throat> a locust. Locust can't hit me because I have five evasion. So there. Like I can't hit me either. What is that? That is a that's a medium. It's a fire starter. Oh, I want a fire starter. Last time I saw those ones, they were they looked like fun. Yeah, look at that. Look at all those flamers. It's a light mech though, but still, still. Okay, um, that would ruin his day, for sure. Waiting for orders. I'm just wondering if it's better to do a little less damage and, uh, yes, Commander. you know, just trying to tr totally trash him. Um, get more salvage. That's the other thing I've, I've realized is that uh, we're not going to do that. I could do that. That would totally kill that thing. <clears throat> if you, the more you mess up the mech, the less stuff you get. With less salvage. So if you like just blow up his head, you get uh, three salvage pieces, which is what we need to get a full one. Uh, the more things you blow blow off it, the less uh, less you get. You know, maybe I should just hang on. What's our initiative here? Um, they're all going there, which I'm guessing is all the turrets. So we're all going to move before any of them go. go. So, oh, sorry, I hit the wrong button. I hear ya. So we are going to actually blow up that that guy. <clears throat> no, but we're going to use the other one. We're going to use this one uh, because it does less damage and less stability damage. All right. And it still, should still kill it. There we go. <clears throat> Pow! Right in the kisser. My turn, and it should be my turn. Oh! I was under the impression that I was going to go all of me before they got to go. They must have a medium mech somewhere. That's weird. See? There's no reds here. Strange. Very, very strange. Now, Behemoth could... I don't want to get too close, though. Like, I could jump over and uh, punch it, you know? But, uh, that's risky. That's risky. So, what I c hmm. What I could do is, with Showtime, I could, like, jump... Uh, no, I can't. I was thinking I could jump up on a thing and then walk, but I can't. if you jump up on a thing so they can't walk to me, obviously I can't walk to them. <clears throat> what is that? That's a mineral field. Uh, so it's harder to hit me, but it's harder for me to hit as well. But it's much harder to hit me than it is for me to hit them. So I think we're going to do it. Then we're going to 
Oh, maybe it wasn't such a good idea. <clears throat> I could totally take that thing out, though. Probably like that. That's 55, that's 90, just over 90. 96, 98. Uh, but that's if everything hits. What's this do? Uh, I forget if that's a... Or I could just do that. But, I mean, those are really poor odds of hitting. So that doesn't seem like a good idea. We're going to do this. Like that. Just to make sure we kill it. I didn't kill it! Oh, I did. <clears throat> Target destroyed. Target destroyed. Okay, it's my turn. Now the thing... How do we save these? That's what I'm wondering. I could do a precision strike. But that's with with that, that's not really gonna do anything. Precision strikes aren't that good against We are gonna go closer though. <clears throat> We're gonna just hope she doesn't get overheated. We are gonna try and precision strike this thing. Uh in the foot I think if we knock it over I'm gonna have a hard time standing. Uh, did get minus one initiative. We didn't get the foot, but we almost got the torso. On and you, glitch. Uh, you're gonna get closer. Um, uh -huh. You can shoot a long way. What is that? That's a spider. I don't care about spider right now. I care about this guy. <clears throat> That's really gonna wreck his day, though. Which. Um, means less salvage, but I think we can do it, because that yeah. thing is pretty dangerous. Even f even for a uh, light mech. There's lots of mechs over there. We're going to have to be a little careful. That didn't do too much. Now, if it does heat us up, we can actually just walk into the water. Is that the turret? That turret is... Uh, I wish... I wish I could see what actually shot at me. The camera is not always great on this. This that's what uh ooh, okay. So I have to blow it up? Is that what you're saying? Is that what you're saying? Because I can do that. I can probably walk over to that, punch that thing, and then see it and shoot it with my long range. <clears throat> that's a panther. I don't like that panther. I don't like that. Okay, we're gonna take him on because I can't have anyone shooting at my LRMs. Okay. Um, he lost an initiative, so he is. You can't walk over there. You could land on him though, like that. That would severely ruin his day, uh, but it would also very much ruin my feet. Um, I'm going to do it just for fun. Yeah, I know. I missed! But somehow still knocked him down. Okay. I guess I'll take it. Oh! It's running away. Well, I'm not going to... I'm not going to catch up to it now. It's not... Not fair. Uh, I guess I should have gone for it right away, but... I can see it, but I can't shoot it, and I don't have... I don't have sensor lock. Which means I can't shoot it with my LRMs. <clears throat> uh, I guess he gets to go now. Nope, nope, oh, we got some bigger... Got some bigger fish coming. Oof. Warning. Armor breached. Yeah, armor's Internal breached. Damage. That's not great. What was that? That is a griffin. Okay, we're gonna I'm venom and you. glitch are the ones that are actually left here. Yeah, that's uh. Yeah, this is not great. 
Uh, well, let's aim for the head, I guess. It's not gonna, not gonna work. Let's go for the torso. Okay, we got a torso. We didn't kill him though. <clears throat> it's unfortunate. Oof! We're gonna have to move him. He is. Oh! Oh, he's gonna get knocked over. Oh, that's not good. What was that? There's a mech behind there that I can't see. That's a griffin. We are probably gonna try and shoot the griffin. Uh, I think we're just gonna give up on that uh, ammo truck. Now, are these guys, they're all standing so I can't blow up a crate. Well, he is. But that's only gonna damage him. So I don't know if that really makes much of a difference. Where is that Griffin? Jenner, Griffin. Has a lot of armor. All it has is a PPC. Maybe I should finish off some of these other guys first. Like that guy. You know? That thing has two LRM 10s. I think that's where we're gonna shoot at. Okay. Target destroyed. I think we went in a little bit too aggressive. Which is, seems to always be my problem. <laughs> Okay, he ran away. Got a Can't on see me. him now for some reason. He must be behind, behind all those buildings. Oof, that was an AC. He's gonna fall over. It's very unsettling. Ah, oh, he fell over. Son of a gun, he's gonna. We're gonna lose our centurion. <laughs> I have bigger fish to fry than that right now. That's kind of that's kind of that's kind of far away for f flamer, isn't it? I, th I certainly think so. Hmm. Well, at least we can ignore that injury. Oh, son of a gun! I should have used Vigilance on him. Should have gone first and used Vigilance. Oh, right in the crotch. Not that it matters on a mech, I suppose. Okay, we're gonna blow that thing up. I don't... I don't... Sorry. Sorry about the money, but... There's that spider again. Jippa. Waiting for orders. Um... Hmm... Gonna have to be. We're gonna use Venom. Panther? So we have a Panther and a Jenner. And uh, where did that big guy go? I'm gonna blow that guy up too. So I think that's what we're doing. Guess we may as well just stay here. So we're gonna hit. We're gonna hit this thing. We're gonna hit that thing. Uh, and we're gonna do. These are exactly the same. So we're gonna do like that. Multiple targets confirmed. I guess I should have checked if that was enough to actually blow the stuff up. Okay, we... okay, that guy's Okay, well that helped. I wonder how much money I gave up doing that, but that was quite helpful. What? Are you kidding me? How am I supposed to kill that? I guess stepping on it would help. Oh, that's upsetting. Can he, can he get up? Stability warning. When does he get to go? He gets to go here. Okay, that's why. Uh, fire starter, spider. What does the spider have on? Lasers. What does this have on? A laser machine gun. What does this have on? Flamers. The only way we can do it, we can do it like that, I suppose. Can't attack that guy, no. What is there?
Yeah, sure, right in the front. I don't want somebody to shoot that ammo crate to blow me up. That would just be terrible. I guess I could have blown that up. And get the money from him, but not the money from that. Oh. He's gonna die. He's totally going to die. We're gonna blow that one up. Waiting on you, Commander. Coordinates received. You're gonna blow up this crate right there. I can't see it. Ah! Well, I guess that uh, means we're doing this here. Commencing alpha strike. I guess I should have used something. That did nothing. That's unfortunate. Oh, there's another mech over there. Oh! Oh, he's gonna die so much. Warning. Armor breached. Yeah, I know. I know. I'm fully aware. Stand up. Okay, that got rid of all of our stability damage, at least. Let's see. Oh! Oh, good grief. Scarcely. Um, I think we're gonna do that so that we can take side shots from those guys over there. We're gonna do this for sure. I'm gonna shoot something. What are we gonna shoot? Probably this guy so we can kill it, eh? 10%? Why is it so low? Oh, because we stood up into a mineral field. Long range. Target moved. A whole bunch of reasons. No, well, take pot shot. Oh, that was the wrong guy. Oh, I didn't hit with anything anyway. Well, that was a terrible waste. Okay, it's my turn. Okay, he gets to go first this time. Uh, we could punch that thing, but that's awfully close to those things. Um, but I can if I move. Somewhere like. Where can I move to and still see that ammo crate? Here. Plus, they can't see me. Okay. No. No. Yes, sir. 25. Here we go. Fire, I will. Oh, I guess I should have done two just in case I missed. Did I kill it? I think so. Yes, I did. There we go. Oh, killed that thing. It didn't damage that, but did I not get that at all? Did I not even damage him? Wow, that was a nice zoom in on that. I did. Oh, yeah, I did. Yeah, these guys I'm gonna just punch. Uh, that was, that's okay. Sure. I'll punch you. With my, what's going on? Who's moving? Oh, good. Phew! <clears throat> my turn. Okay, Behemoth. Or Glitch. Not that guy. I'm gonna make him unsteady if I hit him. That wouldn't be a bad thing. I think we're gonna do that just for the just for the chevrons. And then we're gonna attack that griffin, because I'm very scared of him. Fire at will. If I'm lucky it'll knock him down. It will not, but it's close. But I didn't make him unsteady. Okay, I'm okay. Mostly okay. Okay. Venom is up. Or behemoth. Spider or this guy. This one has two lasers. This one has a laser and a minigun. Machine gun, not a minigun. Um, probably here. It looks like it should be from the side, but I guess it's from the front. It's just, a, just on the edge of it. Uh, I think so. 
should do 100 damage. There we go. Got his torso. And uh, made him unsteady. An enemy transport has escaped. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry. I'm here. Took longer than I thought it would, but... I would like to shoot... He's too far away, I can't see him. Would have liked to shoot that... Uh... Would have liked to shoot... That Griffin, but I can't see him. Walk like this. I'm gonna try and do a multi shot. Maybe I'll be able to kill two of these. Pretty poor odds, actually. Uh, let's do it. Okay, we did a little bit of damage. Uh, didn't really do much there. <clears throat> okay, that was the car. That thing, whatever that thing is shooting at me again. Don't like it. I know. I know. I'm fully aware of the situation. Thank you very much. Okay, everybody gets to go first. Oh, he is so close to dying. I only killed three out of eight. One, two, three, four. That's seven. There's one more that I don't know about. Oof. Those, if those laser hit the torso, I am in very, very bad shape. Uh... Oof. Five chevrons, it'd be very hard to hit me up there. And I can use vigilance. I don't know if this is a good idea. What is that? That's a dragon! Oof. Well, I guess I better fire at it. Hmm. Better than that or better than that? It's probably better, hey? Do some stability damage out of it at least. <coughs> that did a big fat load of nothing. It's okay. Oh, there comes the Griffin. Oh, well, he's not even gonna shoot at me. Yeah, I can shoot at that too. Very hard to hit that. Uh... Ready for orders. <sighs> um, yes, Commander. Glitch. Can I... Yes, I can see you from up there. Got it. Gotta get these guys. He is almost dead, and he's almost unsteady. So that's what we're gonna go for. Oh, he got his arm and his torso. We got an injury, and I think we knocked him down. Nope, just minimum steady. It's close though. Enemy yeah, I'm sorry, Arano. It's uh, having a situation here. Okay, yes. Behemoth. Venom. Uh, we are gonna do Venom first. What does that have left? That thing can only punch me. Which I'm not too worried about. Oh, that's the last one. So one, two. That's all five of them. For um, she could potentially kill two things here, although I thought that last time and it didn't work out. But I wonder if we should try and kill that thing instead. Um, I think we're gonna go for the... the griffin. It's indirect fire, but we should be able to do it. I'm really, really glad I added more ammo. That's a dragon, that's a griffin. Fire all the Hopefully that'll kill it. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, and, the and then Behemoth. Standing by. You're gonna have to go and punch something, I guess. 
This one has two lasers. Yeah, that's the one we're punching. Uh, from here. Right in the tummy, hopefully. Yep, right in the central torso. And a little laser to rub it in. Okay, enemy turn. That's going to be the dragon. Oh, those five pips really came in handy there. Okay, short time. How much can you attack with? Uh, that's going to overheat. That's going to overheat as well. That's going to be a terrible idea. What if I jump in here? Shoot from behind. That's really not going to help much at all. Oh, it just doesn't show. Maybe... well, you have to go first. You're gonna go Vigilance again. Can't really move, can you? Well, you can move closer, but... Ah, uh, you can move away. Uh, he can't see you there. You take that panther out. That's probably a better idea. You have fairly good armor on the back, so I think we're gonna do that. Then you're gonna shoot at this guy, but not with everything. Twelve. Uh, we're gonna shoot the SRMs because that's better odds of hitting something that blow up. What kind of cluster? Oh, almost didn't get him. Okay. Two left. Two left. Not pleased. <clears throat> okay, behemoth. Yes, Commander. I think she's just gonna smash this thing so we can get that over with. Acknowledged. Oh, I didn't kill him. That's interesting. Commander. Um, can't see him. Well, that's not. That's not. I'm not okay with that. Uh, Alright, oh this one has a token. Doesn't really, doesn't really have a jump chat. Okay, we're going to use vigilance on you because I'm guessing that dragon's going to come and shoot at you. Like that. Shoot! I guess I should have loaded it, unloaded everything. Stem than by. Uh, this one also only has one jump jet, so. Punchy punchy time? 65, it's not super good, but <coughs> we'll take it. There we go. <coughs> not supposed to do melee with these guys, but it was so close. Okay, here it comes. Oh, right in the back! Ah! Let's not do that again. Yes, you are. I'm sorry. I hear ya. But now this guy is going to take some internal damage. Everything. Fire at will. It's going to do a bunch of stability damage. Showtime. He's going to shoot from behind. Oops. Showtime. He's going to shoot from behind here. Um. Oh, can't see it. So we're going to move a little bit, move here, look that way, shoot at him from behind, can we... We can't shoot with everything, but we can shoot with all the SRMs, and hit from on the weak side, and a little bit behind maybe. There we go, got an arm, made him very, very unsteady. Um, go here and shoot with everything. No, 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 no. What did I do? What did I do? What did I do? Can I reload? Is there auto save? Oh, that was that was stupid. Um, 
Autosave. Was that the last one? I don't know if it autosaves every minute. What time is it? It's every five minutes. No, that's that's half an hour ago. Oh, Commander. That's really upsetting. For many, many reasons. That's a forest. That's a weird looking forest. On my way. That is very, very upsetting. Okay, we got some explosions and stuff there. That hit something we did knock him down though. Oh, well, we did knock him down. Oh, I'm so upset right now. We would have gotten the second bonus. But now we're not. So sad. Whoa. We're gonna need a big repair bill here. Yes, Commander. Orders. Let's see. What kind of damage can we do? Overheat alert again. Yeah, do it. Shoot. <clears throat> Good to go. Hemoth. Oh, just can't get there. We can get her and shoot him in the back though. Roger. Everything, including a laser. A laser! Precision strike. We shoot there. There's nothing left there. Uh, we're just gonna shoot. Nope, not not that. This one. Shoot him down. Him I've got. There was no overheat, was there? Critical hit the LRM. Inflicted some heavy damage. Oh, it's unsteady. Good to go! Let's just do it. Um, overheating uh -huh. here, but... Okay, we got the left leg. Does that knock him down? That came from. I think it does. Sure does. Pilot injured. I'm receiving. And, um... Uh... Order, and uh, let's take the attack and let's try and kill it. Hopefully, we can get there. We go. Okay, we saved three, five ammo crates. Oh man, I'm so upset I did that. <sighs> okay, go away, victory. Well, I would have been happier if. Uh, I would have been happier if I hadn't blown up that crate when I didn't need to. I was a little hasty on the trigger. 15% I probably got 30%, that would have been another 150,000, that would have been very nice. Uh, but such is life. Still got a decent payout, um, we're going to have to spend a lot on repairs. I didn't lose any limbs, so at least I got that going for me. <clears throat> so there's a the fire starter that I want. Uh, it's not... there's the griffin. There's a dragon, which I have a part of already. 60 tonner, that's a heavy. Uh, Sisada, that's a 40 tonner, I don't care about that. We're gonna get that, even though it's a light. It's, it intrigues me. Uh, then we're gonna get the griffin, I guess. And unless there's something really exciting here, which there is not, I'm gonna get a whole bunch of jump jets, most likely. <clears throat> you get 11 additional, so I might get a panther or a spider, or maybe even the Jenner, which I'm going to sell promptly. Uh, I did get the Jenner, so I'm going to sell that promptly. Um, laser, three jump jets, a couple of heat sinks. Okay. Um, just pick up the hiccups. Let's see what else is going on here. It's going to be a little cutscene and some talky talk here, I'm sure. Talky talk, make talky talk. And, um. Black box. Norby Rod Smith. Achievement there, too. My Lord Curses, what a pleasure to see your face again. Long did you serve House Arano, and long were you a friend to me. Your loyalty and wisdom are remembered to this day. Simon Cur uh, Curses. Spare him in the pleasantries, lapdog. You're here because your mistress needs something. Isn't that like 
Right, Lady Rano. Go on, speak for yourself. You don't need a Madeira to speak for you. My lord cares this. My forces have just liberated your system from director control. But this time yesterday afternoon, I was waging war on your behalf. As your liege lady, I require your loyalty and the aid of your technologists, and I expect you to provide it. What you require means nothing to me. For the last three years, your uncle has squeezed House Carazas for its labor. His directorate conscripted my house guard, looted my treasury, took my children, all because I kept loyal to House Serrano. Well, uh, don't you want... Uh, where were you while you were sworn aliens were on their attack? While your people were being slaughtered, you were hiding in the damn frontier. I saw you little broadcast from Wildry, by your own admission, you left us to die. Um, I'm gonna go with the exile. Such impudence. If you want anything from me, mercenary, I advise you to keep your mouth shut. Uh, we understand the hardship you have suffered, sir, but from this point forward you will show me the respect that I am due. Your own son was released from captivity by my hand. I fought and bled to set him free. You say my auto, yes, but he isn't the man I remember anymore. The prison administrators on Waldry did something to his mind. And my daughter, Lena, she supported you, you know. Even after you bend us to our fate, she refused to break faith with you. She sang your praises to all who would listen until the director made an example of her. Lena was barely 20 years old when she died in your name. My fealty to your cause died with her, and so, if you want my help, you will compensate me for it. You have a job for my technologists, and I have a job for your mercenaries. We'll trade service for service, or you'll leave here with nothing. How about I just come to your house and smash it? Is that an option? I'm so sorry, Lord Karasus, I didn't know. As a member of the Founding Council of the Oregon Coal Ar Coalition, you are entitled to my help, and you shall have it. My mercenaries will assist you with whatever you need, and I will always see the task personally, I have my word. Da, 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 da. Go on then to invite Paladin's first moon, there's a ship, the new grange that needs to be dealt with. My people listen to the details. Blah 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 blah. They had more than missions down there, Commander. There's a warehouse full of busted up dragons. I'm not going to tell you about the dragon's a good mech, but it's big and can carry a lot of guns. If you bring them on board, I'll get them working. I'll look in the shop for them. Uh, okay. I'll take a look at the contract. <coughs> <coughs> I really, uh, I guess we did get a Jenner. We're gonna sell it though. I really wish the UI was a little more snappy. Uh, got the financial well, we got the money, so it's all good. Okay, uh, should we go up? No, we're gonna keep right where it's at. What does this mean? Oh, that's how many months I can survive? I think so. We're gonna go for uh, normal. <sighs> Let's check out the store. Dragon. I have two out of three, so I could buy. I could buy that. And uh, well, what I did want to buy was. Uh, well, my voice breaks like I'm a teenager here. Wasn't there a gyro here? Equipment? No. I guess there wasn't. I thought there was. Uh, that would be the first heavy that I get. Two 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 five. I don't know if it's any good. Uh, it's the lowest. It's the lowest of the heavies, which usually. LRM AC five medium medium. Uh, it's tempting. Wonder if I could fit one of these on it. Uh, it's a large laser plus one accuracy. Eleven ten plus PPC plus uh, you know hmm fascinating. Let's go sell that Jenner. Gotta get rid of it first. Um where is it? Is this guy? Yeah, Jenner. Let's uh put that into storage. And then let's uh, fix our stuff. We're gonna. This one just needs repair. It's one day. That's not so bad. This one needs repair. That's not so bad. Three days. Oh, that's not so bad. I thought that was gonna be much worse than that. Oh well, I'm not so happy. Not so. Not so upset anymore. Um. Uh, contracts. Let's just take a look at served coal. Two and a half. These are too easy, so I think we're going to go straight to that one in the next episode. 2,416,000. Uh, hmm. 
abundance of caution. Well, that doesn't sound like my style, but I do I do appreciate the uh, concern. Let's do a ship upgrade so I can get that. Uh, see how much money I will have after. Uh, I feel like we should do that one. Structural reinforcement. I think we should do the beta pods so we can get this guy. Or this guy. I would like to get this guy uh, for the extra medical point. It's one. I don't know how much of a difference that's going to make. That would be good for the extra tech points. Uh, yeah, we're going to do the beta pods so I can get that training thing. Uh, I don't care about that at all. But, here it is. Um, then let's buy that dragon. That'll be our first heavy. I, I, f oh, I don't have much money left. I feel like I'm going to be immensely disappointed. Just have that feeling. But, uh, it is what it is, I suppose. Can we uh, sell? Yeah, there. We're going to sell this for 300,000. That'll put us in a better situation financially. We can actually afford to have a payday. Um, let's go check out the med bay. Mech bay, not the med bay. The mech bay for our dragon. So 60 turners, our first heavy. Ugh, really? It has less armor than our... Well, I mean, that could be because it's not fully fitted with armor. Uh, which is the case. Which is the case. So where are we going to put on this baby? Let's, let's strip it. And, um... Uh, hmm. Full armor, we have 14 tons left. Just under 14. Now, what are we going to put on this thing? We don't have any jump jets available. That's weird. What do we have for weapons? We have a PPC... We have some PPCs. There's 7 tons, so we can fit 2 of those. And, uh, never cool down. Uh, this is six tons, so we could fit two of those. We could fit, uh, we could fit two of these, I suppose. That, no, no, it'll have to be like this, I suppose. And then some SRMs, just the one. No, I could fit two SRMs. And now we are full. We probably need two of those. Heat efficiency is very high, so we'd need a couple of heat sinks, most likely. What's our heat efficiency now? 3660. That's uh, pretty sad. But a lot of that is from the laser. Probably wouldn't do an alpha strike every time. <clears throat> What's our armor now? Terrible. I wish it would tell me the total armor. Oh, here it does. 800. So if I take one of these off and max the armor, then it's still 800. That must be what it's currently equipped at. Oh, I don't want to add. I don't want to add together. Um, it's 200 max. So that's 240. Ah, oh, that's too much work. Um, let's see. Sorry, that sound there really threw me off. I guess we could put LRMs on. They need two large lasers. Just large lasers? No, because they only have two, two each. We could do two. We could do two support. Maybe I could do like a machine gun thing. That could be fun. They. Yeah, sorry. I meant to do the ammo. This is very good heat efficiency now. We can get some of the heat sinks. Probably all of them, actually. Well, let's see what we're doing for armor. See, now. Now we're packing a punch. Now, if I put someone who has a uh, high... Oh, I even have room for... Room to spare. Uh, hmm. 
interesting, 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 interesting. Um, so I read a thing about, I did a little bit of reading. Uh, I feel like I needed to a little bit. These, if you can get down the, what's the word, the armor, these will wreck everything that's inside because I have such a high crit chance. So this is a skirmisher and a brawler, which means it's short. What's the what's the melee damage on this puppy? Does it say anywhere? It doesn't actually say, does it? Um, beefy machine takes serious beating, but tends to be a bit light on weapon. It moves fast for a heavy mech, though, which makes it well suited to closing for melee against other slower targets. Yeah, I suppose that that is true. <coughs> Put an AC-20 on it. Couple of machine guns. How heavy are these? Are they a ton? Half a ton each. Um, how many? 200 rounds. And uh, they shoot f five. 200 rounds? But only two of these then. And they shoot 20, 20 turns. Well, I'm never going to shoot that much. Uh, my max armor though, so I could probably do. I could probably do like an SRM. That's two tons. I have almost two tons available. I could probably do like a. That's a little much, probably. Oh, where's my armor now? I want a lot of armor. But I could probably do an SRM 4. And, uh. Mostly maxed on the armor. SRM2, do we have anything in the store? SRM2++ or something? SRM10+, PPC+, SRM2... No, we don't. What about a PPC+, plus? it's just extra damage. Maybe if it was extra stability damage, I'd go for it, but... Laser+, plus. extra accuracy is always nice. Hello! <laughs> hmm. Mm, maybe. 20 stability damage. Though I may as well just get this PPC then. Smaller. Does more damage. And doesn't require ammo. Makes it a lot more heat though. But if only shooter every other time, it doesn't really matter. Stick it on here. Now I'm overweight, but <clears throat> this can shoot from very far away, so we're just going to leave that. Uh, but should I get that laser plus? I'm surprised I don't have a laser plus. Didn't I have a laser plus? Did I click on store? Yeah, I did. That's why it's so slow. Plus one accuracy. Uh, 172,000. Uh, I need money, though. No, I don't need money because I just had. Get a flamer. That'd be fun. Two of those on there. Uh, we're gonna get this guy. Yeah. New stick it on. <clears throat> Pull it, put it on here. Plus one laser. Uh, plus one accuracy. That's that's pretty sweet. Okay, confirm. We'll give that a shot. Uh, six days. So one, four, nine total. Thirty days. Good. Okay. It was flashing red. I think we're gonna put it up top like that. Once those two finish, we're gonna do that other mission. But this is the end of this episode. So if you want to watch the next fun episode of this game, uh, which is gonna be this guy, make sure you tune in for the next episode. Thanks for watching.